Good day, everyone. The book of John, chapter 1, verse 5 says, The light shines in the darkness, and the darkness has not overcome it. This is an apt response to the situation that South Africa and the world find itself. The phrase unprecedented times has been overused that it has evolved into truism. No one would have predicted that the global trajectory will shift from COVID to the Eastern Europe war within a split of a second. We must all unite and pray for a quick, peaceful and amicable resolution to this potentially volatile standoff. Few can argue that the world has been on the brink of disaster for a while now. While it is tempting for us as the Christian media to join the chorus of despondency and frustration, we should fastidiously endeavor to resist giving in to that edge. In these seemingly dark times, we as the Christian media have an obligation to become a bastion of hope, largely because we know of the hope we have been called to. There is a need now, more than ever, for the modern day Christian media to become a catalyst for social change within our communities. This means that the Christian media must make the deliberate and intentional effort to create programs that will seek to ameliorate the plight of communities that they operate in. If our efforts as the Christian media are focused towards becoming a bastion of hope to a seemingly hopeless community, then we will be a light that shines in the darkness and no darkness will overcome the world. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, we present our lives before your throne, O God, that Father, as we are faced with the challenges in this world that we live in, we ask you that you strengthen us to indeed become the bastion of hope to our communities as the Christian media. We pray that, Lord, remove any fear that the devil may instill in us and give us hope, O Lord, in all the situations, challenges, and stresses that we may be faced with. We pray that you encourage each and every one of us in the work that we do, that we endeavor to bring change in people's lives and to impact the world in a positive light. And Lord, we trust you that you'll bless us all. In Jesus' name, amen and amen. May God bless you.